Hey guys, and welcome to Cryplay's Broken Age. This is a game made by Double Fine. You know, Tim Schafer and his homies. This just recently came out on Steam, and I've heard nothing but good things about it. That makes me excited, which is good. That means I'm gonna play it now. Oh, that was when I was testing things to make sure things. Fuck it. gonna be here soon and you know how she is all right dad that's my boy oh here comes your mother there's my little angel oh computer snooze no more snoozies for my little spaceman this morning oh i hope no bad tinkle fairies came and wet your bed during the night <laughs> oh computer off come on and get up shay lots of important adventures to go on today all right all right get What a good boy. Thanks, Mom. Okay, let's clean up that dirty little body. Hey, easy, computer. Oh, quit being so shy. I used to change your diaper. Fuck yeah! Oh, or what difference does it make? Sure, what difference does it make? <laughs> what the hell was that thing? Oh, I'll take your Good spoon. Morning, Commander Shay. Hi, spoon. It is my honor to be your trading spoon today. Uh, okay. Yes! You won't be sorry, Commander. So I need a training spoon? Stay on alert. I think there might be food around. Always, sir. Right right here? I wonder if this bowl is as sick of cereal as I am. You wanna Do you wanna use oh pour into the milky breach? It's happening. It's really happening. Now, sir, I don't just serve food. I also serve up nutrition facts and eating encouragement. For instance, that last spoonful was exactly 7.1 calories. Did you... Uh-oh. Uh, Commander? Aren't you excited to see what the big deal is? Up on the bridge? No? Well then, want to know the viscosity of this morning's synthetic milk? Sure. Okay, computer. What's the big emergency? I wish you'd call me Mom, sweetie. I wish you called me Captain, computer. Okay, Captain Sweet. Let's get down to business. We are currently tracking multiple developing crises that need urgent attention. First of all, a massive avalanche has been reported on the planet Galactica. Second, there's a runaway train in System 7 that's headed for Spike Canyon. We've also received a Mayday signal from the vessel Friendship Circle. They're under attack. And, uh-oh, this just came in. My sensors are reporting an entity of unknown origin has attached itself to the hull of this very ship. What are your orders, sweet, uh, Captain? Oh. Uh, so, are we playing children's games? Sun Mom? I'm down. We need to help those avalanche victims. We need to help those avalanche victims. I knew you'd want to help them, sweetie. Flying a course for Planet Galactica. Help! Help! Someone help us! My toes are really chilly! This is the massive avalanche? It's worse than it looks! Really? How? That's not worse. So, do you... Do I have my spoon? I do not have my spoon. 
Or maybe I do. Here, I'll help you out. Take your time. Eating isn't a race. Got a special nutrition paste for you today. Space meat in a blanket. <sighs> Ready for your next exciting space mission, honey? We've got an avalanche, a runaway train, a spaceship under attack, and a mysterious object on the hull. Ah. <sighs> Well, they already had my daily dose of ice cream, so I guess we'll go on the train. Let's catch that runaway train. Aye, aye, Captain Sweetie. To System 7. Do I spoon him? Here. Okay, Spoon. Get ready. I'm going to throw you at the bridge man. I'm happy to volunteer for that suicide mission, sir. But I think if you just shout at the bridge man, he'll lower or raise that bridge. Okay. I don't know how long I can hold Yell at the bridge man. You can let go now. I got this. I'm not letting go until that bridge is down. The, I'm losing my let, let go. We got this. Wake up, rich man! Okay. What an odd thing. Hang on, I got a mission to let the cat in because he won't shut up. Okay, I did the mission, mom thing. I gotta go defend friendship circle? Sure. I wonder if it'll involve those little furry things again. Probably. We have to defend the friendship circle. Oh, I just don't know who would attack those poor defenseless cuties. To the teleporter room. I'm aboard the distressed vessel, Friendship Circle. I found one of the crew. I, I'm here to help you, fairy thing. Again. What happened here? There was an attack! From an enemy vessel? Or an alien creature? Or... Did you attack yourselves in a fit of space madness? It was a... Yes. Uh, That's a terrible attack. Time for more adventures in Sleepyland. Yeah. That looks like a good idea. Morning, buddy. Up and at him. Hey, who wants breakfast? Uh, what? I feel like I'm living this again. No. Yikes. No way. Simmons. Uh, bugs? I think I'd rather eat a bug. 
How many holograms? Oh fuck yeah. Sounds good. Sounds good, computer. Your saliva has a 0 0.001 pH imbalance today. May I suggest more whole grain nutrient paste? What mission should we go on next, sweetie? Well, the only other one we didn't do is this, so... That, I guess. Better suit up and investigate that foreign body. Oh, I don't like you going out there. Let's use the safety suit. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, I'm outside the ship. The foreign body must be very close by. I gotta say, I love your scarf. Also, it looks like I can click and go to her side of the story at any time. Because it's just there. But let me fix this first. What the hell is this thing? Touch it. I found the object. It appears to be something organic in nature. Something's telling me I should stick my face right into it. Ah! Get off of me! Get off! Got a special nutrition paste for you today. Egg salad sandwich. Gnarly. <sighs> What mission should we go on next, sweetie? Ugh, I gotta get out of this routine. Yeah, I feel you, homie. Uh, fake train wreck, please. Fake train wreck, please? I knew you'd choo choo choose that one to System 7. Yep. However, I, uh, kind of wanna change it to this. Hey, it works! Neat! Hi. Guess it's time to face the cupcakes. Nothing wrong with that. I like my name. How's it going, lady? Worried that I chickened out? No! I know you're not afraid of anything. I mean, what's to fear? This is a great honor. Right! Wait, I can't tell if you're being serious. Well, there is one part that I'm really afraid of. What's that? I'm afraid that you won't get any food because I'm gonna beat you to the Maiden's Feast. Dream on! I think she just beat me to the Maiden's Feast. Ah, <sighs> sugar bunting. Where the sweetness is baked right in. No time to go to town now. Get in the house. All right, lady with a cupcake hat. I'm going. Are you Hello? Is that a light? No, it's not. Surprise! That's a light. Whoa. Yay! There is my Valoria. Oh, look at my pretty girl. I can't believe. I just can't believe. We're very proud of you. I think that's what your mother is trying to say. Oh, she's not even dressed yet? Can we do that after cake? Come on, cake first! All right, but come on. Let's get this good time over with. Oh, yes, cake. Now, where did I put that knife? Nobody touches that cake until I find the ceremonial knife. <sighs> is it under this, Mom? Hi, Grandma. Maybe the knife is under this towel. <laughs> Never gonna find it. 
Dad, I hope you're not hiding that knife for your own good. <laughs> Silly old man. Hi, old lady. Can I hang out with you? Lavina? What is it, girl? Um... Can I ask you about the Maiden's Feast? Can I ask you about the Maiden's Feast? Weren't you paying attention in Maiden training? No. What is Mog Chathra? What is Mog Chathra? The latest in a long, distinguished line of Grand Mogs to visit our land. Distinguished? Well, anything that lives that long becomes distinguished. I mean, look at me! <laughs> oh, you're weird. I like you. Uh, how much do we know about the Grand Mogs? How much do we know about these Grand Mogs? The Grand Mogs have visited our lands for as long as anyone can remember. They hide in the wilderness for years, and then they come to feed. After feeding, they return to their land and, it is imagined, breed. You actually imagine that? Eh. <laughs> You're bouncy. And it looks like you have bread in your hat. Cool. How many of these feasts have you organized? How many of these feasts have you organized? Let's see. A new Grand Mog appears every 14 years, and I'd have seen six of them, so... Hey! Are you trying to get my age out of me? I'll never tell. Uh, you're just old, it's okay. Why was I chosen? Why was I chosen? In every town visited by a Grand Mog, the villagers vote for the maidens who represent their town's best qualities. So in other words... Beats me. That was an insult. Eh, I'll take it, I guess. Where do creatures like Mog Chathra come from? Where do creatures like Mog Chathra come from? They come from beyond the Plague Dam. I want to go beyond there. I want to go beyond the Plague Dam someday. It's forbidden! But maybe you'll be lucky enough to be taken there soon in Mog Chathra's stomach. I'm going to be eaten? Oh. Uh, Mog Chathra attacks other towns? Mog Chathra attacks other towns? Of course! Maryloft just had their Maiden's Feast yesterday. That's how we know he's coming here next. Uh, they're a pretty tough act to follow. Amazing feather work. Okay. I think I know all I need to know about the Maiden's Feast. All you need to know is how to look pretty in your dress. We'll take care of the rest. Huh. Uh, why don't we just fight the Mog Chathra? So, why don't we just fight Mog Chathra? Silence! Talk like that could ruin the Maiden's Feast. If you destroy the feast, Mog Chathra will destroy this village, including your family. Is that what you want? No. But he's going to eat me. Where's the knife? Any idea where Mom's knife is? We're late! If I knew, I would have cut that cake, shoved it down your gullets, and had us out the door already! Oh! I'd better go look for that knife. And hurry! If we're late, you won't be selected and your family will be shamed! That's a good thing if I'm not selected. It's like the Hunger Games, but you want to be hungered. Hey, old man. Grandpa Beastender? Huh? Uh... Why are you grumpy, Shakes? Why so grumpy, Gramps? Because we're celebrating something that's a mockery of what this town used to stand for. Oh. So you don't like him? Good. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this Maiden's Feast either. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this Maiden's Feast either, to tell you the truth. Then fight it, girl! Stand up for yourself! I hope you're not filling that girl's head with nonsense, Brommel. <laughs> I like the nonsense. Why do you hate it? Why do you hate the Maiden's Feast, Grandpa? Because this used to be a town of warriors. It's a travesty, Bella. Why'd we stop? Why'd we stop being warriors? Levina Clench and her ilk said there was too much bloodshed, pushed for appeasement. So we went soft, became a town of bakers. Speaking of bakers... Hey, Gramps, want a cupcake? Um, yes. <laughs> Damn right you do. And do you know where the knife is? Do you know where Mom's knife is? <laughs> Wouldn't tell you if I did. I'm not doing one thing to help with this shame feast. I'd better go find that knife. Don't you dare. I hid it for a reason. You did what? Oh, nothing. 
like you. No luck. Um. Do I? What is this? One of my mom's special dish towels, and it's still dry. Oh, I took the towel. Okay. Um. Well. Leaving. Yep. Okay. Hey, Dad. Don't suppose you have another knife in the back we can use? I do, but your mom brought out a special one she wants to use. She wants everything to be perfect on your special day. The special day where I die. Thanks, Dad. Uh, pie? Not until I find that knife, young lady. She already caught me using my fingers. <laughs> Eyes in the back of her head, that woman. Typical dad. Hey, kid. Know where mom's knife is, Rocky? If I did, we'd all be eating cake right now! You make a good point. Um... Uh... Mom? Oh, so frustrating. Mom, I was just wondering, what if we fought the monster instead of feeding it? That's my girl! Now that's beast ender blood talking! Please, my loves, don't make this any harder than it already is. Hmm... <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, fine. Well, I got Zoomy when I went over here, so maybe he's got it hiding around. Grandpa Beastender? Huh? Uh, no, 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 no. I'd better go find that knife. <laughs> yeah, and then like check. Stupid Grandpa Beastender. Okay, <laughs> maybe not. My grandpa doesn't look too happy about this feast. My grandpa doesn't look too happy about this feast. Your grandpa is just stuck in the ways of old. Your grandma was the same way. Bless her soul. Not all of the town elders have stayed as hip and with it as I have. I don't like you. I mean, I like you, but I don't like you. Don't touch the red ones. Mom made those just for me. You're going to eat all of those? I've already had six. Jesus. That explains a lot. Oh, right, he wanted a cupcake, so I needed to go give him a cupcake. Eat the one you've got before you grab another. Mom, it's her special day. Let her have all the cupcakes she wants. Except the red ones. Good point. Grandpa, I'm giving you a cupcake. Take it. Losing my mind. For me? Um. <sighs> Split it with you. Split it with you? Deal. <laughs> you. I, I need that knife now, I'm sorry. On second thought, you can have the whole thing. Suit yourself. Now, where did I put that thing? What thing? Uh, nothing. Uh, I didn't say anything. Good old grandpa. Alright, I can get killed now, or we can eat cake. I don't know. It's my mom's special ceremonial knife. It is. Stab her with it. All right, time to serve this girl up. But first, can I ask just one more time? Honey, why don't we just kill Mog Chothra? <laughs> <laughs> here, here! <laughs> oh, honey. Oh, we're going to miss your sense of humor. God damn it, family. Majestic to behold. Awe-inspiring. Powerful. Mysterious. But Mom Chathra is more than that. Merciful and generous, Mom Chathra keeps our town safe. All he asks is may he pick some of our beautiful flowers as he passes through. Please come, Mom Chathra, and make your selections. Welcome to the Maiden's Feast. Show him what you're made of, fella. I know he'll pick you. This can't be right. No, it's not right. I, I, bird. I should be in the center. Um. I make myself the center of any Hi, you with a drumstick. Mass, maybe. Um, you're making me hungry. You're making me hungry. I'm trying to make Mom Chatter hungry. These girls have it all backwards. Think it's attractive to starve themselves. Oh, you fattened yourself with drumsticks. Cool. Want to trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Want to trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? 
Do you need a towel? Need a towel? Nope. They taught us to eat daintily in finishing school. I'm warning you, buzzard! I will fuck you alive if you come near my food again! I like your spunk. About the satisfaction of helping out a fellow maiden. How about the satisfaction of helping out a fellow maiden? Hmm. Sounds good, but not half as satisfying as this drumstick. Never mind. Yay, you're cool. Hey, what do you say we break out of here? Hey, what do you say we break out of here? Trying to get us all to quit so you'll win the feast, huh? Well, it's not gonna work on me. I'm in it to win it, baby. All right, you brainwashed fool. Bye. Just wanted to say good luck. Bye. No. How about Delish? Hey, does that costume have any thorns we can use as weapons? It does, but they're made out of chocolate. Regardless, I accept my noble burden, not with apprehension, but with joy. I give my life so that no harm comes to our village. No, I give my life. No, me! Sheesh. Sorry, but you have nothing about it. Creepy people. How about cake lady? You can use your candles to burn its eyes. Don't distract me. I think I've got a chance to win this. That's good. How about you drink me, lady? You're like a soda pop. Hey, I've got a plan. I already have a plan, thanks. Attract Mob Chopper with my slender frame and be remembered forever as a hero. Well, good luck. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. one of these things. It's nice to be armed, but I wish this were more monster-sized. Uh, cover myself? I don't need to dry off. No time to sweat. Yeah, it's kind of important you do something. Need a towel? Uh, I always open the bottle carefully, <laughs> so no. Okay. Um, tell the bird? I need to tell the bird, I think. All right. Tell him. Hey, need a towel? I think you got a little maiden on your cheek there. No? Okay. Tell the bird. That is here. not the bird. Hmm. Not working. No, it's not. All right, stab the bird. I don't want to stab that bird. Why not? It's nice to be armed, but I wish this were more monster-sized. Do I just talk to her? Uh, I want to trade something for that drumstick. Want to trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? Uh, how about something bubbly to wash it down? How about something bubbly to wash it down? Actually, I could use a swig of something. Okay, I'll see what I can get you. Okay, thanks. Just wanted to say good luck. Bye. All right, progress. I need your thing. Uh, can I have a drink of that water? Hey, can I have a drink of that water? Trade you for that sweet corset you've got on. Never can be too thin. This horrible thing? You got a deal. 
Score. What a relief. I feel so much. Oh, I'm sorry. But this thing's just too big for me. Trade back. Oh, that poor girl. Oh. Oh, no. That should have been me. I need your bubbles. I need that. Can I borrow the bottle one more time? Can I borrow that bottle one more time? Keep it. Thanks. Ooh, I don't need it where I'm going. That's good. Bye. Hey, hey, take take the bottle. Give me the drumstick. How about something bubbly to wash it down? Well, thanks. Don't mind if I. Look at me! I'm soaked! Oh god. Is that okay? Quick! Quick! Help me put myself back together! Uh, yeah. Here. Oh, wait, 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 no, no, no. Tell. Here, take it. I've got a towel here if you throw me that drumstick. You have a towel? Why didn't you say so? Oh! <laughs> How long have you been standing there? Are you part vulture or something? Probably. How can you think about food at a time like this? Put this on him. Gotcha. That's it. Okay, you cut yourself free. Blue with hey, how about we split this cupcake? You can have the bottom half. Finally! Get back here, you crazy brat! That's my girl! She's doomed us all! Log Chocolate's fury will soon rain down upon our village! That was a lot more difficult than it should have been. I'm just not cut out for these things. <laughs>